All right, so Bar made a level a fair amount of time ago, so we're gonna play it. Figured why not? And then I don't know what we'll do after that. I haven't figured it out. We have a goal of beating every single Barb level, and we have done that so far, except for this newest. As you can see, actually, I don't think I played one. Oh, this was just a puzzle level. Maybe I'll play anyways. You know, I haven't played it yet, but the rest I've cleared and liked. Yep, see, every single one since the first one these ever made, back in June of 2019, when the game first came out. Final Destination, no accidents, no coincidences, no mishaps, no escape. I actually have heard of this movie before. I haven't watched it. But yeah, he names his uh, levels after movies, and I literally have never heard of half of these, but I have heard of this one, so let's play it. Point 17. Wait, I saw a comment stop. Speaking of movies, I actually watched one recently. It's called One Cut of the Dead. And I think you should, uh, you should all watch it. Was that correct? Did I do that right? Uh... The movie's really bad, but it's one of my favorite movies now. And I guarantee you, a lot of you have never heard it before. Wait, I think I have been doing this right. Okay, that was way easier than what I did before. Okay, we're gonna get some momentum here. Oh, I have to time this. That was weird. I thought I softlocked myself somehow. That would have been funny. I died anyways. Oh, this is a tough to time. This is like almost more of a puzzle than a Kaizo. Oh, I got stuck in the block. Dude, this is actually really hard to time, wow. Oh, okay, I see. I think I wanted that to happen. I think. Need to time that. Okay, I see. Oh, I went way too early. I don't know if I mentioned this anywhere, but I have considered uh, asking Barb to... I think I actually brought it up with him. But I wanted him to make one level for Super Dream World 3. But, I mean, I haven't even worked on it, so maybe it'll happen. Maybe I'll put in like the bonus world or something. Barb exclusive level in my hack. That will never come out because I haven't worked on it. Go. I just made up a visual cue and it worked. I will make up another one right- Oh, he's gonna wake up! Okay, I had no time to think. I was gonna like run up and throw it like right here. Cause I think I need full speed to make that jump. Ready, go. I went way too late, didn't I? Heck. Throw now. I'll throw it at the top of the slope. And go. I need to go earlier. Go. And kick. Alright, kick it slightly earlier. Go. Okay, go earlier, you idiot. Go. Kick. Kick way earlier. Way earlier. Barb like doesn't play this game, and he's made more levels than I have in the past two years. Go. Kick. Alright. I have to wait there. This definitely gives me a... Uh... Like ROM hack level design vibes. It's hard to explain, but there is a pretty distinct difference in like level design stuff between Mario Maker levels. They're like the crazy ones and then like ROM hacks. It's like an OG ROM hack type of level feel. Which is something Barb does well with like Mario Maker levels. Makes you want to make hacks again. Oh, I was, I, there's a slope I can get up. I was like, wait, how do I get back up? I made Dreamworld 1 when I was in college. It took me two weeks to make that entire hack. Dreamworld 2 took me two months. And with the state of ROM hacks now, you kind of need to actually make good quality levels. I mean, that's always what I wanted to do, but like the bars and 
made so high. It would take me probably at least a year to actually focus on Dramble 3 and make it look and feel as good as I want it to be. Also, I, I've been like trying to figure out more creative ways to troll people. Alright, not just the classic put a Kaizo block. There have been some very intricate trollage and I love it. So I gotta take some notes. I wanna do unique things with that, with Dramble 3. Very unique things. Speaking of trolls, we getting trolled, Barb? We getting trolled? Yeah, jump for joy. Yeah, that's what I figured. I think I had to land on the POW. I don't need it. It's fine. What do we do here? Watch, we're gonna one shot this entire second half. Then worked. <laughs> I'm also pretty sure I have my one of my college class projects on there, or I had the codes Yahtzee and C sharp, I think. I was pretty proud of that one too. Okay, I think I one cycled it when I did it the other way. So you do this. Don't do, don't do that. Stop it! Oh, we got a checkpoint, wow. Can we grab it? I think I have to do this in one motion. Oh, I'm so smart. I saw this ground, I was like, there's no way. There's a muncher there. Okay, what do we do here? How would Barb construct this snake block? Would it go straight up or would it do a little zigzaggy action? Why do I just kick the pound out, huh? Was I supposed to do that? Probably not. Oh, you know what I'm supposed to do? Okay, I think I... Actually, what do I do? <laughs> No, don't start over. Wow, that still worked. Oh, I guess I don't need to do it in one motion. Well, let's just not do that for now. I'm definitely doing something else here, though. Figure it out later, I guess. heck is this? Why do you just kick it? It's, uh, what we, well, yeah, I think I, I th maybe I see what to do there. I think. I think I see maybe. Perhaps. Is that supposed to be like a troll that I dodged? This. figure it out with my big brain no I was trying to duck uh this is what I envisioned I'm not sure how correct this is though I was trying to do something like that but I feel like that is incorrect okay is that correct I don't know if that's correct but it kind of works How do I get Mr. Thwomp here to not hit the pow? Can I make it past this Thwomp? I wanted to do this, but the other way still worked, I guess. Oh, maybe it's better if I do it the way I did it. You know what? It works, it works. Don't fix what's not broken. Pretty sure I just had to get by here. 
Wow, you can. Okay. Oh, heck. Okay, well, I need this muncher to be raised all the way up top somehow. Yo, thanks for the thumbnail shot, Barb. Okay. Hmm. Let me go back to the way I was doing it before. Shoot. Come on, brain. You can do it. You can think. I need my Jimmy Neutron brain blast. Hey! Okay, that's what I was trying to do. I was trying to do that, but I want to work. Now, now you're working. Alright, this isn't it. I don't know what it is. Okay. I give up. What, what am I doing? You throw the pow up? What? That doesn't kill the muncher? Does it really not kill the muncher? What? Okay, I thought it was going to kill the muncher, so I never tried. What the heck is this? The solution, that's what it is, but... Dang, I really have to throw that up, like, precisely. To catch it again and... Throw it up again. Oh, never mind. It just goes to the next one. Uh, I see. Okay. Dude, the, the worst part is when you know both Super Mario World and Mario Maker, the, the physics are different. So sometimes my brain gets mixed up between the two. Or it makes assumptions. Like, what the heck? That should have went up. What is this? All the pals aren't in the original Super Mario World. But like, you know, vines act differently in this game compared to Mario World. Shells kind of act differently. Springboards and snow blocks act completely differently and it makes me mad. That's why in, in uh, Mario Maker 1, my fourth level, I, was it my fourth? I made a level called No My Yoshi and it was cheesed horrendously because apparently you can duck with Yoshi and go through one tile wide gaps. In Super Mario World, you cannot do that. That's why I was like, what? When I saw the cheese and it made me angry. Because the game physics are different. Because ducking when you're small in Super Mario World does not change your hitbox whatsoever. And if you know that, now you know. Can you grab this? I don't know, I, I mean, probably needed that, pal. Well, I don't know. We'll see if I need that, pal. Because I can't really grab it. So hopefully I don't need it. Unless there's a way to grab it, then I'll have to figure that out. The Falling Fish, dude. The Barb Classic. Uh, what the heck is this game? This is a very precise part. What the heck? I hate this game. Why? Like, that definitely should have killed the POW. I threw it really close that time. And it's... The POW's alive. Do I go where the fish is? I go where the coin is. This one, uh, there's gonna be one where I don't go where the coin is. Oh my god. Aw, oh, I was hoping for, like, the, the coin troll, man. I don't care about the one-ups. Hold right, don't get trolled. I got trolled. Do I have to duck? I think it's a duck. That was a 50-50, I was like, me, I either, like, jump at the last minute, hold right. I guess it's like a 33-33. Either jump, the duck, or hold right. I think it's just a duck. I saw that and I was like, there's something behind the goal, so I'm holding right and praying for my life. You play enough levels, you, you know you know when to sense a troll. You know what you don't know what type of type of troll it is, but you can you can just sense it. Now I'm scared throwing it too early because it's just the pals is gonna evaporate. If you guys haven't seen the Germal 2 montage where I troll people, Bar makes a freaking appearance. There's where, there's one where Barb he hits a coin block and he's like, suck my ass, Panga, suck it. <laughs> uh, that was a good one. Suck my ass, Panga, suck it, suck my fucking ass, you piece of shit. Now Sony had a bad mic too. It's like why, why? I have not seen Crouch level. I will only play it if it gives me YouTube views. If not, I'm not playing it. I already played his one hour the, des the, the desert night one. 
a while ago. It took me like an hour and a half. But it got on me a lot of views, so this only time it was worth it. Charles levels are too evil. I'll play like, you know, some troll levels, but his are just beyond evil. And we'll only do it for content, not enjoyment. All right, we, we do a little quack, a little quack quack. There it is. I wonder if you could re-enter the pipe. If you see the muncher going at you, re-enter the room. I wonder if that would have uh, been a save. That's okay, we beat it. Good level. I spent, I would say, half that time literally just figuring out how to do that muncher part. All right, wait a little time. Let's try the uh, other bar that I never played. I think it was the puzzle one. I had the worker on this one for the longest time, but now I don't. Yo, if you guys haven't seen Rush Hour, though. It's a good movie. Fifth million dollars! The Wand of Barbalon. I don't think this is a movie, is it? Is it? It could be. You dare bring light to my lair? It's Zelda? Dang. Is this puzzle? Oh, this is actually a level, I think. Wait, I thought this was a puzzle. Maybe I should play this. Now, how do I get you, Mr. Key? Oh, I don't. I, th I shoot an arrow. I thought it would just, like, teleport me over there. Is this the checkpoint already? Yo, look at those. Whatever. This is oddly satisfying. Look at the stretchers. I gotta figure out when the tail ends. Okay. It's got quite a bit of ways to go. I never miss. I think I'm not supposed to... I don't know, I, I kind of just died immediately. Let me not move. Alright, don't move. What do we have to work with? Alright, it's a uh, don't look right, or don't look left. Wait, how do I... Hmm. I don't even know if that was what I was supposed to do. Peekaboo. 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 Okay. I use that time to think. So if you jump in midair- What? Okay, I guess it's because I have a link. Usually when you jump in Super Mario World or Super Mario Bros, then you hold left in midair while you're facing right. You still face right. But I guess uh, with the link suit's different. No, I can demonstrate here. Ready? Jump. And you see? I'm still facing left. What else can we use? So it's not the sword thing. It's not this. We got the bow. Probably the bow. Bob bomb No, we gotta, use, we gotta use the bow. So there is a coin on my bottom right, bottom left that I'm covering up. Heck. Oh! What a shot, dude. I gotta, I gotta really hit that. I guess I can make it with momentum. Okay, that was way easier. I thought I couldn't reach that. That was the worst shot of my life. I didn't even shoot. That's how bad it was. I don't even have to bounce off the cannonball for this. This is not... Okay. That's an interesting use of the bow, though. Never seen that. to bring this. You lost your parachute. Today I learned you lose your parachute. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that, was I? You moved the springboard? I'm learning so many things. Watch this advanced cheese. I bonked. Alright, so we have to do some one motion, probably. 
Don't know what we're doing here, though. We're going back to the cheese. Shoot! I'm pretty sure I could th uh, I mean, I could at least get up here with the cheese. Oh, I see. Okay, I time it. And then we throw a bob on the ground pound here. Why did I think this was a, like an actual puzzle level? Well, it's kind of a puzzle level, you know, like a traditional like five million logical steps together and not like a Kaiser level. I'm down for this though. Oh, that's to time this. I think I do. What's in here? Nothing. Look at Bar being nice and leaving indicators. Or, uh, what should we call it? For timing. Line up visual cues. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, there's some light. I think I missed my ride for lighting. I think it's still going down. I guess I'll keep them as a source of light. Oh, I went too early. I don't know if I need to hit that block. I don't know why I pushed up for some reason. I didn't see what was on the left side. Spikes! I see! We're supposed to not do that. We... There's a bum bum fight! I think I'm somehow alive. Am I supposed to be down here? <laughs> Is this a Zelda reference? Probably. Wait, was this the right way? I thought I was supposed to fall down the coins. Was this the right pipe? Oh, apparently this was right, huh? Sick. No, I was doing so well. Wait, turn around, Bowser. <laughs> Dang. Did I, did I somehow dodge a barbed troll with the coins the wrong way? Oh, maybe we should use the spike balls instead of... Or do a combination of both. Actually, probably not, because it blew up the spike ball. I forget how much damage spike balls do. I gotta memorize that chart. Or at least have a link to it on handy. Uh, well, see you later. Heck. I'm gonna do that. Hit spike ball and then and then throw a bob bomb for the ultimate wombo combo. Oh! I'm gonna play further back, so I have more time to react to the fire. Like that. Oh! I saw this pipe. I'm hoping it works because I. No, I need to get the spike ball here. Oh. Okay. I thought it was DLC. Just in case, is a block? No block. Alright. Well, I should have played this a while ago. The only reason I didn't is I thought it was a, like an actual traditional puzzle. But that was fun. Pretty challenging. Good job, Barb. Took less time than the other level. 0.4%. Alright, we have finally completed every single barb level again. Yay. Let's see, how many has Barbie in the last two years? He made four in 2022, but he didn't make any in 2021. I made how many in 2021? I made zero in 2022, but I made a few in 2021. I made two in 2021. Whatever. <laughs> Barless, always a treat to play some barb levels. Nice fun mix of Kaizo, somewhat puzzle, and trolls. Oh yeah, Carl's all got deleted, right? I'm not playing his little, I'm not playing his troll level. I'm saving my sandy. Or else hope you enjoyed watching, uh, and we'll uh, 
continue to play his new releases whenever they are.